So today we're here at the Patterson Park Community Center getting ready for our annual community baby shower in partnership with the Rutherford County Health Department sponsored by St. Thomas Health. And we're really excited about this event because it's an opportunity for us to bring in new or expecting moms and provide educational classes on having their child start healthy in life. We'll also have on hand the St. Thomas Mobile Health Unit. Rutherford County EMS will be doing car seat safety checks and there will be more than 50 organizations who will be on hand to be able to provide resources and information to these new or expecting moms on opportunities to get their children the best start in life. We've had many support from our corporate partners in providing bottles, diapers, and blankets to help us provide baby bags and door prizes to get these moms in the door. But once they're here is when the magic really happens. We're really excited to be able to provide more than 20,000 items this year through this baby shower. On behalf of St. Thomas Rutherford Hospital, we're so excited to be involved once again in supporting the community baby shower with the health department and the United Way. For St. Thomas Rutherford, we really want to make sure that our community is as healthy as possible and we believe that starts at birth. And so if we can reach out to moms that are vulnerable and may need some additional resources and bring them into the fold early, that means connect them with the appropriate prenatal care, means connect them with resources if they're struggling in a particular area that could benefit them right now and then also their family and their child when their child is born and if we can let them know what that labor and delivery experience will be like within our walls then maybe there's a comfort level and sort of we generate some excitement with somebody that might be nervous about about going through this experience for the first time. I found out about the baby shower from St. Louis Clinic. It's my doctor's office and they told me Tuesday come here come early so I'm here. I learned here today from the sheriff's office that my five-year-old does not need to be in a harness car seat unless it's 60 to 65 pound harness. My message to other moms would be even though that this is my fourth baby, I learned a lot here. There's a lot of information that you just wouldn't know. You think that you would because you have three other kids, but you don't. Every baby's different um, and if you come to this baby shower, you definitely will learn new information.